Hi everyone, it's me West Coast Mom and today we are going to work on a basket weave pattern. And so this is what it looks like. It has two different textures, just like a basket weave right over and under would look like. So there's this part which is a little bit more prominent and 3D it sticks out and then there's this part which is the opposite. The best part about this pattern is that you just have to know how to do a double crochet stitch and that's it. So. Uh, anybody can do this. It's a great beginner pattern, but it also looks really nice. It adds a really nice texture. What's great about this pattern is that it is reversible or double-sided. So here, these are called my front post because they're pushed out. This is called the back post, but when you flip it over, you'll notice that it is the reverse. So isn't that neat? So it's double-sided. So if you're making something like a baby blanket, which is what I've made um, using this pattern, it doesn't matter, you know, there's no such thing as, oh, it's upside down, right? So there you go. Like I said, all you need to know is how to do a double crochet pattern. So this is great. And it works up really quickly. So when I'm doing my double crochet stitch, normally we go through those top loops there, right? Like that top V. However, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go lower down and I'm going to go around from back to front the actual double crochet. And what that does is it kind of pulls it forward like that. So I'm still doing a double crochet stitch. That has not changed. Yarn over, but go around the actual double crochet, what they refer to as the, as the post. Yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two again. I'll do it one more time. So like I said, I'm going around that. And like I said, it makes it sort of push out. Now, I'm going to do around the back post. What I'm going to do there is still a double crochet, but before we went front to back, now I'm going to go in behind and I'm going to come forward because remember on the back is the opposite. So I'm going behind it, not the actual loops up top, but behind the actual double crochet and doing my double crochet that way. And so it's pulling it back, so it's doing the opposite. So there are so many different possibilities with this. You can work out how many squares you want to make it, um, how many stitches depends on the type of yarn. And this works out quickly. You can do it in stripes. You can do it in a solid pattern. It makes a really nice sort of heavier and denser sort of texture and weight to it. Uh, so this would be great for uh, afghans and blankets and like that. So, and like I said, it's so easy. All you have to do is know how to do the double crochet pattern, but it adds a little bit more texture and density and thickness. And I love the fact that it is double sided. So there you go. You just, with the double crochet pattern, you can do this easy basket weave pattern. All right. Thanks for watching.